Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome to the stream. Been a while. I haven't... I haven't really uploaded anything all year, really, besides the first stream. Um, just currently working on the new achievements that have come in uh, in the division with the last stand expansion, so I thought I might as well kill two birds with one stone and uh, do a bit of streaming while I was playing. Because um, <coughs> as I say, I've not put anything on my YouTube channel for a while, so it's only going to be a short video, hopefully about 20-30 minutes. Give uh, my dedicated subs, YouTube subs, uh, a chance to uh, hear what I've been up to. Um, I might do another stream, well, recording, dependent on um, what I get through in, in this stream, as I did. I intentionally wanted to record something, record over something that wasn't The Division, you but seeing as I'm playing it at the minute anyway for these new achievements, I thought I may as well record. Um, but when I do eventually polish off these achievements, get out there. I might record um, over s whatever else I'm playing. But yeah, so... This new DLC... Um, it's alright. I mean, it's, it's not really my cup of tea because I'm not, you know, a... Dark Zone kind of guy. If you love the Dark Zone, you're going to love this DLC. If you're not into the PvP of the game, um, I don't think you're going to enjoy it too much. I mean, I'm, I'm finding it okay, you know what I mean, but I would have preferred some more uh, single player stuff, to be honest. That's what, I've, that's what I've really enjoyed about the game. <coughs> the PvP doesn't really appeal to me that much. Um, but I briefly checked out the new areas in the dark zone. They've been expanded now to uh, all the way up to nine. Uh, pretty interesting little areas. I went on a different profile before that's a bit more worky of score so that it was a peaceful trip into the dark zone and uh, you know I, li I like what I saw. Nice areas, nice visuals, a little teaser with the Central Park one area. I think that's going to be in the uh, year two plans for the game. Um, yeah, overall, not bad. Um, I haven't tried the is under enemy control. incursion yet, though. I don't know if I'll bother, to be honest. I, I don't think this expansion is going to be enough to get me re-hooked on the game again, if you will. Because <coughs> I want to keep going with the progress that I've been making like, on my backlog and my other games. Because I, I put this game down like a couple of weeks ago. Well, a few weeks ago and started playing other games, making progress again with completing games and whatnot, which has been nice, and it's been nice to play some other stuff, so I'll probably mop up the achievements um, from this DLC and then put it to rest again, really. Um, I'm just not feeling the... I would say addiction, just... I'm, I'm enjoying the game, but it's not... it's just not been... A, it's not been as satisfying anymore towards the end, really. Um, and that's not a bad thing, I mean, it's done its job for, like, best part of a year, so you can't complain. Um, it's just when I've been, like, you know, pouring hours into survival and then, um, you know, unlocking stuff at the end of survival from the rewards and then it's just kind of like, the buzz is wearing off. And when it starts getting like that, you just start thinking, well, you know, not, point, not much point, really. But I've also been um, playing in the Great True Achievement Score Challenge um, alongside Mr. True Achievement himself, um, Dave Kinetic, uh, Clever Jake and Webchimp. Um, if you don't know what that is, that's basically, well, how do you put it really? It, it's a weekly kind of event. Well, it, it's an event on True Achievements where People will team up, and it's an individual thing as well, actually. People will team up, or participate individually, or par participate in both, and you've got to basically get as much score as you can. Well, not as much score as you can, though. You've got to get enough score to survive every week. The bottom line will be, like, X amount of TA. I mean, I'm not sure how it's calculated. It'll be very low throughout the beginning of the GTAC, but as the weeks go by, it gets harder and harder and harder. You've got to start racking up a lot more score to stay in. So, just been participating in that 
Um, and then again, working on the backlog, really, so we've been playing a bit of um, Final Fantasy, um, the pre-order bonus that you get without the King's Tale. Um, gosh, what else have been playing? I finally mopped up Miss Explosion, man. That was that was a good completion. Um, Oh, I healed up last second. I'm trying to think what else I've been playing. Um, all sorts, really. We're working on the completion percentage as well. Where's he gone? Oh, there he is. Get him, come on. See, my little buddy's died. I'm going to stick here and defend. Yeah, I've been knocking out a few of my easy completions as well. On her. Which is a very, very easy thousand. Oh, I still complete that actually. I'm saving that last achievement actually. I got one more achievement to do in it, but I'm going to save it for my achievement streak. I've got my streak back up as well to about 60 summit days. So that's pretty good. I bet this guy's going to creep up on me. Well, I don't expect it. Okay. I'm going to push C with these boys because I need to capture some objectives and stuff for achievements. Although the winds would be good as well, so I won't push too hard. That's a good, that was a good heal that you got, isn't it? Ah, no you don't. Oh, he shouldn't have died there at all. Happened to be turret, man. I best have got that then. I didn't get it. What is what?
But if you still set me on fire. You can just lie there and suffer. <laughs> Oh, that's another thing you gotta do as well, get them bonus, bonus points, I've just gotta get that. Hopefully. Support me to it, Jesus, yeah, do we know? I think someone's gonna come through that door. Look at him, he ain't clocked on. I don't know. Oh, fucking EPM. EPE. <laughs> That's ridiculous. That is so ridiculous. Yeah, I've been working on a lot of uh, Peggle as well. That's taking a while to do though. I mean, I've not really put as much time into it as I should have done, but I'm getting there with it slowly but surely. I need one of those bonuses. Might be a decent one to cap, hopefully. Yeah, I was holding off trying Peggle for a while, but uh, I'm glad I checked it out. It's a pretty, a pretty decent looking game. It just when I first looked at it, it just looked a bit too luck based, really. But it's not been a bad game. Kills, quite a well done, well done game. Quite. Um, Bravo's now neutral. Obviously, it's quite highly received. So I knew it was going to be good. I just, I was just hesitant to try it myself. I thought the achievements might be a bit. I mean, they are. There's, there is a few tough achievements on it, but they are doable with enough uh, enough patience. That'd be free. And be one. <laughs> you like that little shoulder action, do you? <laughs> That was some bullshit. We've got Bravo. I'd like to see. Got air back. Kicking rogue ass. A fortification is under fire. Oh, they took B off us again. Bravo's confirmed neutral. Oh, I tried to record it. <laughs> I'm streaming. <laughs> Fortification eliminated. Alpha 
is now neutral. Your spawn relay is inactive. I've also been playing uh, NBA NBA 2K17. I uh, played that one, another easy one, for the uh, prelude. Um, it was an easy game, was go off that. Not a bad little game, actually. Very kind of very complex controls compared because I was a massive fan. Oh, no. I was a massive fan of um, what's it called? NBA the NBA Live series until they went downhill, which was very simple. Simple controls, quite easy to play, quite easy to get into. It was a much more arcade-ish style than uh, NBA 2K, uh, the 2K17, the uh, 2K series has been. And I've been playing What in the World on Windows Phone, which is just another easy game of score. Uh, Gears of War, slowly but surely, did did a bit of co-op uh, with Dazzler playing that. Uh, besides that, I've done a, a little bit of horde here and there, not too much. I need to get back into that. Um, I played the Assassin's Creed Chronicles series as well. They were really good. Really enjoyed them. Uh, did I put together the walkthrough for China? I think it was Assassin's Creed was China. Uh, I think it's been well received so far. A uh, bit of Payday as well. Got back into Payday too. Popped up a few achievements of that. Still got a lot to go on it. Uh, again, I need to get back into that one at some point. Probably. I think some games now are getting pushed out of the rotation because of GTA C. Because it's, it's, you know, unless you know for sure you're going to be able to nail the harder achievements, they're not really worth spending all of my weeks, spare time working on. You know what I mean? So that's been kind of sidelined as well. Um, Cleaned up Mafia 3. Um, not a bad game overall. Gameplay wise, I wasn't amazed. I thought there was going to be a lot more to do. I thought it was going to be a lot more complex. But the storyline was pretty banging. Um, there's uh, DLC for that coming out actually, so I need to uh, keep an eye on the news for that. And that's been about it, really. Final Fantasy, I started that the other day. Uh, I've only done a bit so far. I mean, so far, so good, like. Seems to have been alright from what I've played. Um, but I'm looking forward to getting into that. I'm saving that for my nights off, though, for my peaceful nights. Because that's one of those games where, you know what I mean, you, you don't want to be being disturbed and shit by kids and shit like that. Was there not another thing? Yeah, that's yeah, no, been about it, really. Besides that, just mainly uh, working like a twat as per usual. Um, still no joy in the new job front. Although I am trying, believe me. Since the beginning of the year, since I've been searching, I've been knocked back about eight or nine times now. Which is really getting annoying. But the sad thing is, people don't tell you why. Which would really help. But I understand that obviously doing so would create like you know a full-time job for somebody so to speak so that is what it is and that's been about it really family's doing well kids are brilliant all well and healthy um missus is doing good i'm doing all right you know keeping a happy face and just marching on Dodgy that in it. That's his pulse freaking out. Yeah, so I've not been doing much on the video for. Well, I have technically, because I've did loads of videos for the Assassin's Creed Chronic Assassin's Creed Chronicles China walkthrough, um, and then I did. Well, I'm currently doing the walkthrough for a King's Tale Final Fantasy 
as well. I've, I've kind of like dedi dedicated them to the True Gaming Network as my contribution to like the walkthrough, uh, not walkthrough team, the YouTube team that I'm a part of. Speedy Gonzales, there. I think we've been overrun here. Language. Look, as if them boys didn't. Oh, fuck off. Fuck right off. Got Bravo. I'm trying not to get too bothered about it. <laughs> I just want to get me achievements and get out. Because this, like I said earlier, this isn't something that I'd come back um, <laughs> daily for. If it were more single player content, then maybe. Like I said, though, if you, if you like the Dark Zone, you're going to like this shit, but. I'm not a fan of the PvP style in this game, it's not, I don't know, not all that really is it, not compared to your typical, um, typical multiplayer games. Let's get these objectives. I'll just run past them. Man down, man down, what are you doing? Oh, he's dead. That's what I mean. It's just, it's just tacky. Alpha's now neutral. Well, I don't. I'm not really a massive fan of the shock cover, but I have to abuse it to try and stop players in the track, so I can fucking, you know what I mean, do damage to him. Otherwise, I'd, I just, I can't win the battles most of the time. And this guy as well is all about his firearms, and he's got the exotic gloves that do more damage Bravo's when no other gear neutral. sets are active, and he's got. Barrett's uh, bulletproof vest, which has three different perks for like three different times, and I'm still getting my ass whooped. And that guy got shocked as well, and he still just carried on running. It doesn't make any sense. Why are you clapping for like like your class or something? You see, like it, there's nothing to to have a buzz about from getting kills in this game. There's not there's not really a massive skill to it, is there? Ten seconds until tactical boost availability. You 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 or your friend hit me with a grenade and you finish me off. Like this, it's great that you you are working tactical together like that, but it's nothing activated. to get proper chuffed about. You know what I mean? 
Plus you've got the fucking numbers as well, you bastard. It's not even worth the trouble. With that many people on B, you may as well go somewhere else. There's no point running. Running back on constantly just to get killed over and over. Plus, the, I need to go to the areas where I'm going where I'm gonna to have a better chance of capping. Because the capping is... Well, it's technically more important. They could all sit on that one area and we'd win off the other two areas. Plus, they're still not keeping B as well as they should be, considering how many people they got on there. So I'm going to take a little detour. It hopefully pays off. It's a, it's a big trek, though, between... Uh, wow, you laggy bastard. Fucking... Oh, like you pretty he was. He'll be back though, he'll come back to this objective. You've got points for kills active. Bravo's neutral. Fucking turret slow you down to fuck. Oh. Where's that other turret? Oh, look, same guy. Thought I was behind the cover. <laughs> what a dickhead. Oh, never mind. They went all the way down to the under hostile control. If you want to take on turrets and shit, though, you've got to have a, like, a, almost a different build. Winning though, that's the main thing. I know it's sloppy, but. <sighs> Opportunity though. Gone up, King. Gone up, King. You can't hear me. Because I'm streaming. <laughs> Shit, what the hell was that? That's a bail, that's what that was. I could flank these up to the magnetic behind them. How do you like that? Alright, oh, wrong way. Come on.
Nice, that's a good shot. Fire me gun. Look at the bullshit, he's getting away with that shocking! <laughs> See if I can be cheeky and get that bonus really quick. Come on, come around this way. Oh, he's getting it. Okay, leave it. Oh, but he spawned. Oh, he died. No man. <coughs> You're wiping the floor with him. Taking his time to get that ball. Multiplier tactical boost active. I don't even remember spending any of my points. Happy days. Right, there you have it. I'm going to leave it at that. That'll make a pretty nice video. Well, in terms of length, anyway. <laughs> um, if, you do ca if you do watch the video, thank you very much for watching. And I uh, want to mop up the achievements from this. Um, I'll try and put together... A uh, another catch-up stream, but with, with a different game, because the divisions pretty much all I've put up on my channel over the past year. <laughs> Thanks for watching.